You'll never succeed in trading without following the advice in this five minute video. I know I spent several years working in investment banking and the mistakes I see retail traders make are downright criminal. Why they keep doing it over and over, I'll never know, but here's a chance to stop that. Now this video is an extension of another video I did recently where I spoke about the number one mistake retail traders make. I'll give you the link for that in just a few minutes, but let's move on to deadly mistake number two, which will 100% result in trading failure. Now think about it, to succeed in something as complicated as markets, you know, sometimes when you're trading, it can feel like you're working for NASA, like trying to figure out how to send a rocket into space. Markets are very complicated, but they're also extremely competitive. Would you agree, therefore, you need to be doing things that are completely opposite to the crowd, to the retail sheep? For example, do you see any retail traders studying or thinking about the composition of the market that they're trading? No, they just start clicking buttons, buying and selling on their charts like sheep. No wonder they fail. Now, if you fall into that camp, it's fine. Nothing wrong with that. It's probably not even your fault, given the amount of garbage on social media and YouTube about trading. But are you willing to change it? That's the point. How? Well, to me, it's pretty obvious. Something you absolutely have to do in order to avoid your trading career ending before it's even begun is to start researching different market participants. Take a step back, start thinking for yourself, stop being so gullible and just accepting what you're being told. For example, do you really think it is retail traders on social media or YouTube that drive the market? Of course not. To think that would be delusional. There are professional firms out there that take single trades for tens if not hundreds of millions of dollars. That's potentially more than the entire retail community in a single day. One firm placing more volume than 100,000 retail traders put together. Who do you want to be following or emulating or studying? The big players, of course, the people that move the markets, banks and institutions like the ones I worked at. Look, my point is you need to start independently researching what tools they're using. Do they look at fundamentals? If they do, how are they doing it? Are the trading tools institutions use different to what you see here in retail? If it is different and you're doing the opposite to what they're doing, can you see you have a big problem? Because what you're using to trade is not being used by players that actually move the market. It's a recipe for failure. And whilst I know it's hard to stomach, I think deep down you know that. So instead of being in denial, which is only going to delay the inevitable failure in your trading, do some independent research, find out what the biggest players in the market are doing, and then incorporate that into your trading. Now I agree, doing this research sounds boring because you're not on a chart clicking buttons, but if you aren't willing to find out who your competition is and what they're doing, you have no place in a business as complicated as trading. You're kidding yourself. Now, anyone can do this and should do this. Start to think about which players are driving the markets. You'll quickly realize it isn't retail traders. So it kind of makes sense that you wouldn't want to be doing what other retail traders are doing. Carry out some independent research. Look at a variety of sources about what the big players such as institutional traders are doing. Start doing the same. There's some excellent institutional resources out there. You're also welcome to explore my channel. I have tons of free videos on order flow and even detailed analysis of how institutions analyze fundamentals. But before you do that, I know you've been itching to find out what the other career ending mistake retail traders make is. And to do that, you can go straight to that five minute video here. You can also subscribe to the channel by clicking this button so you receive all my future videos. Have a great day.